name is Ting Hoi Li. For your convenient, you can call me Li. Anyway, if you were watching any of my videos, you know after I lost my job and I getting on this internet marketing journey. So over a year learning, I do learn a lot. So I share my moment with you. Let me see. I open this one. I can show you. Maybe you can't see, but anyway, I'm talking. I'm reading here. Because now every day, basically, I will post on the Instagram. So I have like three days take turns. Like one day is for my husband work, the second it's my daughter's work, and then one day for inspiration. Things I said like late October, I found my life purpose, which is supposed to be serving the artist and. Those who treat art as、uh, their spirit food. So I post, I say something now. No matter what your life purpose is, its foundation should be increasing life for the benefit of everyone. Its focus is on helping and serving others. The longer, the better. I say that way because I realize, you know, like online learning this、uh, over a year. You know, people keep saying, "Oh, we need to make money," you know, earn money. And now I realize when they said, "You cannot make money unless you work at the mint. You can earn money via your service." So now, if when you Whatever you do now, you realize we live in this one world. Whatever we do is supposed to be serving others. That's how we come to this planet. You know, we're talking about the goals, the purpose. We just think, you know, like we're talking. We feel like we understand. But now I realize most time when we're learning. It's not really learning. We just kind of gather information, like me. After you know, I lost my job. I you know, redesign my husband's website, and then I know that that's my goal. But I didn't know that's my life purpose. I just feel like, oh, you know, he's a good artist. I need help. Until after I redesign his website, I'm thinking, oh, I can sell some prints, so I can work at home. You know, just we one we buy another. I'm just like, oh, but after design website and like nobody get on. So and and I do know people make money online, right? So something's wrong. So I feel like, oh, I need to learn online business. That's why in 2019 March I joined the partner with Anthony. So start learning the business like online business, and then in June I joined one funnel away challenge. So basically the one funnel away challenge. Change my belief from、uh, making money online only to serving and helping people. But I'm just, you know, thinking that way. I still don't go really deeper. But then, just you know, in this March, you know, the 2020 is kind of crazy. So you know, the job closed, so I'm staying home, and I just start getting involved with all, you know, like. We call funnel flicks because when you have click funnel, you you know, you have something there just watching, and every single day I'm just watching, 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 and I was happy and I feel like whoa, that's good. I learned, but then I didn't make money. I didn't realize I'm just running around to try to get information until July, like Mr. Bob Proctor and Oprah Winfrey's. Wisdom, like kind of law of attraction thing, get into me. So I'm just start watching their videos, right? Until early October, all of a sudden I realize, oh, I discovered my life purpose. Because I know Dasha over twenty seven years. I know he's a great artist, but I never, I know I will help in his art, but never know that's my purpose. So I share my story with you guys. The point is, we all come here with some kind of purpose. You are the one you need working hard to discover it. 
but it's okay. You know, maybe it's not. It's long term. Like everybody's different. Like for me, I'm just value what I have in this world. Whatever the you you know universe give to me, I just value them. So I feel like I'm always happy. So always value what I have. Maybe that's why I lead me to this far. But at the same time, we also need to learn. No matter whatever happened, you need try to find the good thing. When you stay in the happy, positive side, you're going to attract more good things. Anyway, so now I know I won't jumping around looking for anything else anymore because from the Bob Proctor, you think about it, he read. Sinky and Broadridge things 1961. So now we know we all have our own gold inside ourselves, but we also running outside looking. So from now on, no matter how busy you are, start spend time with yourself. Ask yourself question. Am I happy with my life now? If not, find the reason why. Because our mindset make us looking, working the way we work. But the moment you find this reason, you should start shifting your mindset, and it will be like easier to find the happiness. Like I said, from now on, spend time with yourself. You have to love yourself first, to in order to love others. Because to be honest with you, I share with you guys just like now. I don't know tomorrow what I'm going to do, but at this moment, if I know. I could save someone or helping someone. I just share my message. Never underestimate your message. You may cannot change the world, but you can change one person' world. And think about it. We live in this one world, and twenty first century is so beautiful. Think about it. We can just work at home under our fingerprint. We can just learn from all gurus. On the computer, not like you know they have to traveling everywhere to learn, and then they can share their entire life with them with us. So how how you thinking how lucky we are? So take advantage from this. Don't always looking for the bad thing. Find the good thing, and then you every day you will getting better and better. You know, I I love one of the、uh, the quote. I don't remember maybe exactly. It's from a, you know the back long time ago in China. So you guys pronounce it like a Confucius. It actually Confucius. He says something like, "Life is so simple, but we insist on making it complicated." Most time, you know, we we think about something, we read something, we understand, we think we understand, but when you read the book, you can answer the question. It doesn't mean you really understand. If you really, really understand, you will take action on it, and then think about the life is much easier. Now, don't just looking outside, completely outside. Always something happen, but you have the you have this power inside here, too. Control what you want to do. Don't you want to get happy? Because whatever you plant in your mind, it will return what you plant. Anyway, I'm continue sharing my message. Just thinking about it from now on. Don't go outside looking for stuff. Spend time with yourself. Ask your self question. Set a goal, like where you want to go, and then you know where you are here, and start take action. 
okay when you like like my message please share and also subscribe my channel and i'm going to continue go deeper learn mr bob proctor's law of uh, attraction stuff and i'm share with you guys too talk to you soon just love yourself you are a powerful person talk to you soon bye